In this episode, we take a look at how to get AI signal on your business. Welcome to Click AI Radio, where you'll learn the secrets to transforming your small to medium business. Grant has been helping businesses transform using technology for over 30 years. Advanced technologies like artificial intelligence have been available only to large companies and advanced technical teams. Grant will discuss how you can use to leverage AI and other technologies to grow your small to medium business. As a gift, Grant is offering his ebook, AI for Sales Growth, at clickairadio.com. Now, here's your host and biz tech geek, Grant Larson. <laughs> Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Click AI Radio. So you are busy running your business, right? And of course, you often wonder, is there any way for me to work smarter, not just harder? Well, years ago, in one of my startups, I was working 100-hour work weeks. Absolutely crazy. And I was trying to keep everything moving forward, right? We, we had a very challenging client that really took up 80% of our energy. And the other 20% of the energy was course spent on other clients as well as all the administrative things right that it takes to run a business one night while we were writing and testing a bunch of code I looked at my teammates and exclaimed ah there's got to be a better way and they agreed so we decided to step back and, and we looked at the assumptions on which we we're operating number one could we adjust the clients expectations and number two uh, perhaps we could look at all the information at our disposal and look for insights, things that we weren't seeing. So we did both of those. And of course, at the time, we did not have AI, but we performed something that you might call AI signal. So the takeaway from this story is that by addressing both of those items, of course, we dramatically improved the outcome of the business. Number one, with regards to adjusting the expectations, this was, of course, one of those common sense functions that should have been done months earlier. And of course, I'll chalk that one up as a life lesson. But number two, looking at our data and searching for insights, we found some clues that told us how to improve. So what is AI signal? Well, it's um, it's similar to tipping your toe in the water before fully committing, right? So that, that reminds me of a backpacking story. When our kids were younger, we were backpacking in the flat tops wilderness area of Colorado. And it was still early in the summer. <clears throat> and so there's plenty of snowpack melt, you know, coming down through the streams. Um, and, and um, you know, AI signal, we, we had to cross the stream, right? We, we couldn't find a way across. It was much too wide to jump, but we knew we had to get in and get over to the other side. So AI signal would be similar to testing the temperature of this fast moving water before hopping in, as well as getting a sense of how deep the stream is and how fast the water is moving. Well, did we do any of that? No. And so, you know, we would have saved ourselves some emotional as well as physical heartache if we would have tested out the conditions first. So instead we took a run at it and jumped as far as possible, right? Meanwhile, the fast and very cold moving stream just whisked, you know, whisked us downstream, right? So don't do it that way, obviously. Now this, of course, applies to your business, and especially when it comes to AI. Get some AI signal first on your business data. Tip your toe in the water. So let's look at an example. Imagine, imagine you have one or more systems as part of running your business. It might be a CRM with sales data. You also might have a a lead management system. Now they may or may not be connected to each other. Well, in fact, let's say they're not connected. Now you only have so much time, obviously, and resources each week as a business owner. And so the question is, how can you improve the use of your scarce commodity of time each week? Well, one way to help you do this, to fine tune quickly, is to look for AI signal. Well, what does this look like? Well, let's, you know, when you do an AI project, if you don't use a turnkey provider like Click AI, then you're gonna do the work of cleaning up the data and getting it ready for AI. This is, it is and can be a really significant effort on your part. And it interrupts, of course, all of your other business operations. But what if you could find out if there's enough predictive behavior in your data before you even spent the time to clean it up? 
So this is what AI signal is, right? It's an AI technique to preview your not so prepared data and run enough AI on it to determine if there's some signal in it that could ultimately be used to one, improve your efficiencies and two, grow your sales. Now, in the example that I gave above, you know, you may decide to look for signal in your lead management data. And separately, you may decide to look for signal in your CRM data. But if there's enough signal in the data in one or both of those systems, you may want to knit those together or have a turnkey provider knit those together for you. So for example, if your CR CRM system has a history of sales and refunds and things like that. Imagine the value of connecting your leads data to your sales data, of course, so you could see through the AI things which could translate uh, leads into either sales or refunds. You, you really want to know both, right? The kinds of leads that uh, is going to ultimately translate into refunds, the ones to ignore. Now, of course, it all starts with just getting AI signal. That's a, It's a powerful first step that lets you know if your data has AI potential, and if so, which data elements are the biggest contributors? That's incredibly powerful. This is um, this is better than taking your car to the mechanic shop where the signal may be spend more money in these areas. It's more like having a gold mine and the mining engineer stating, hey, in this part of the mine is a vein of gold. And over here in this other cavern, there's another vein of gold. All right, now you know where to focus and where to dig. So once you've, of course, commenced with mining the material, the, the real question is, what do you do with the material, meaning with the gold, meaning with the insights that you receive? Well, getting an AI signal is exciting, of course, and it's dramatically time-saving. It will save you a ton of time just to know where the gold is. But getting the AI gold is even more exciting and even more impactful. Now, using the quote-unquote AI gold to grow your business and, of course, improve the value of your business opens a lot of doors. All right, everybody, thanks again for joining. Until next time, check your business for AI Signal. It's the fastest route to business value. Thank you for joining Grant on Click AI Radio. Don't forget to subscribe and leave feedback. And remember to download your free ebook. Visit clickairadio.com now.